Hi, Gui Fan. We are here today with Jessica, a vision therapist, to tell us more about one of the most famous techniques in vision therapy is the binocular accommodative rod. Welcome to the show, Jessica. Why are we doing this vision therapy? Okay, um, this is to uh, decrease the latency and increase the speed of accommodative response under binocular vision. Then, uh, who is it? Uh, for those people with uh, accommodative infacities uh, which have difficulties in changing focus from distant and near, and vice versa. So, what do you need to perform this therapy? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, we use the plus minus flippers in the various power ranging from the uh, plus minus 0 0.5 to plus minus 2.5 in a half diameter increments and a reading material which is we use a reading chart. Okay. okay, here we have a patient that complaining of intermittent blur after changing focus. Okay, hi Derek. I'm Jessica. Okay, I want you to put on your glasses. Okay. Again and sit comfortably and relax. Okay? Hey Jessica, are we ready to start? How does it work? Okay. Okay. So Derek, I want you to hold this. Yes. Okay. So we will begin by having a walking distance of forty centimeters from the Derek's eyes to the uh, reading material, the reading chart. Okay. So we will start using uh, the lowest power flipper. Okay. So Derek, this is the plus uh, plus lens in this side mm -hmm. and the minus lens in the other side. Yes. So I want you to hold this. Okay. And view through this line. Binocularly with the plus lenses first. Okay. Okay, with the plus lenses first. Go through this line. So I want you to try your best to clear the print. Mm -hmm. So is it clear? Yeah. Now? Yeah. Okay. So how did you feel with the plus lenses? Mm. Is it? Uh, this is actually uh, helped you to uh, relax your accommodation, just like you are uh, looking at far. Okay. So now I want you to free flip the lens to the minus one and then try to look at this print. Mm -hmm. Okay, how do you feel now? Does it you feel like you are working to focus? Yes. Okay. Okay, Derek, well done. Okay, now I want you to flip back to the plus lenses. Okay, this is considered one cycle. And uh, I want you to repeat this for 15 cycles. Can you repeat now? Okay. Okay. Try to try your best to clear the line. As fast as you can. Jessica, how is it? Okay, now I'm giving a patient as much time as necessary to uh, clear and read the pain. Okay, so uh, actually this goal is to achieve the clear vision so without the time, uh, without the uh, regard of the time factor. Okay, once the uh, uh, patients can um, can uh, complete this task comfortably, mm -hmm. so I will ask him to do it in uh, fifteen cycles, but in a minute. So uh, with the current flippers, is that all? Oh, of course no. I will then increase the power of the flippers to plus minus one, and then we will repeat the same thing. We will do the fifteen cycles within the time lim uh, time limitations first, and then we will proceed to the fifteen cycle in a minute. Okay. So uh, after the patient can really accomplish this, then we will that we will then increase again the power of the flippers to uh, plus minus one point five, then plus minus two, and then uh, so on is plus minus two point five. So uh, when do we stop? Okay, this therapy is continue when the patient is uh, able to successfully uh, clear the plus minus two point five flippers for uh, fifteen cycles within a minute. Okay, before we end this. What is advice to us during this therapy? Okay, uh, spend only a few minutes per day for this therapy. So in the beginning, actually, patient will feel a uh, headache and discomfort. So uh, and 
patient may need more time for this therapy. So as it improves, so the, the discomfort will go off, will disappear, and then uh, then the time will be shortened. So um, remember to do this uh, consistently and try to um, establish a routine so that you can do this therapy uh, at the same time every day. Okay, well Each done. Day. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay.